In December of 2014, a brutal murder shocked the nation of Zimbabwe. A police officer, Nthalon Dovo, was lured into a deadly trap by two self-proclaimed prophets, Patrick Matikitiki and Assurance Moyo. They claimed they could cleanse him of evil spirits, but instead they strangled him to death and robbed him of his belongings. Patrick Matikitiki, a 26-year-old, was the mastermind behind the murder. He had met Lovu, an assistant inspector in the ZRP, at a church service in Wulawayo. He managed to convince him that he had a gift of prophecy and that he could help him solve his personal and professional problems. He asked him to come to his house in Sostown for a consultation. When he arrived, he introduced his accomplice, Assurance Moyo, a 23-year-old who pretended to be his assistant. They told Nlovu that they had to take him to a bushy area near the National University of Science and Technology campus, NAST, for a cleansing ceremony. They drove there in Lovu's car, a Toyota Corolla. In the bush, they asked Lovu to kneel down and pray. And when he did, they attacked him from behind and chopped him with a rope. They left his body in the bush and drove away with his car, 200 US dollars, a laptop, and two smartphones. The next day, they sold the car to a cross-border transporter for 1,500 US dollars. They also sold the laptop and the phones to different buyers. They then used the money they got to buy clothes, shoes, and alcohol. They also paid off some of their debts and rented a house in Lobengula West. However, their crime spree was short-lived. The police launched a manhunt for the killers after Lovu's body was discovered by a passersby. They traced the car to the transporter, who led them to Matikitiki and Moyo. They were arrested and they confessed to the murder. They were tried at the High Court in Bulawayo, and Matikitiki, being the main perpetrator, was sentenced to death by hanging, while Moyo was sentenced to life imprisonment. The judge said they deserved no mercy for killing a law enforcement officer in cold blood. He also said that they had tarnished the image of genuine prophets and churches. The murder of Nshalon Lovu by Patrick Matikitiki and Assurance Moyo was a tragic case of betrayal, greed and violence. It also exposed the dangers of false prophets who prey on vulnerable people. It also highlighted the need for justice and accountability for the victims of such crimes. May his soul continue to rest in peace.